Okay, putting the last uh, string on here. This is the uh, most exciting part because you don't know what you've done. And, uh, you know, it's really um, leading all up to this, this moment. First impressions are always uh, important. Mm. Nice bass. Fantastic first string. I've outdone myself. Oh, oh, could have scratched the guitar up. But, uh, one thing I do at this point <clears throat> is I clip the strings. I usually leave this on until it's all tuned up. Make sure some string doesn't come flying off there and putting a dent in the top. And some guys, man, they leave their strings up here in a, in a big mess. I don't know how they can do it. Drives me nuts. I've got to clip them. There we have it, a brand new guitar being brought into the world. Oh yeah, that's always a sign of a good guitar, that B harmonic right away. Um, anyhow, I'm going to let the strings uh, sit, and um, maybe I'll play something a little bit later on it. I haven't played in like two years, but I'll see what I can do. So that's it. That's the birth of a guitar um, from the finish, finishing standpoint up until now. Um, this guitar is, is really cool because um, it's a spec guitar that I made. It's some wood that I had sitting around that I was saving for just, you know, like a real special guitar. And I thought, well, let me put it together. I've been saving this wood for years. It's the best piece of Brazilian that I have. 
and um, and the top is uh, perfectly split bear claw Italian spruce and uh, with Rogers tuners. So I'm going to put this guitar up for auction. Actually, I'm just going to put it up on eBay, uh, not eBay, um, on um, YouTube. I'm going to do a video of it later today and uh, put it up for sale. Last one I put up there sold the day after. So we'll see what happens with this. Um, but it's truly a, a beautiful guitar. One of, one of the best guitars I've, I've made. So uh, anyhow, there you have it.